There is bad news to report this noon for cell phone users as Google is set to hang up on its free 411 information service. But before you get too upset, the good news here is that Microsoft is stepping up to its place. John Matarese has the 411 on 411 so you don't waste your money. No matter how much you plan ahead, it happens to all of us. You're out on the street on your cell phone, and you realize you don't have a number you need to call. So you dial 411 and hold your breath when your cell phone bill arrives. It, it, it can it be is. expensive. It can be very expensive. Most cell carriers now charge between $1.50 and $2 for a 411 call, and that doesn't include airtime. As a result, some people won't dial 411 ever. So you try to avoid it? I try to avoid it. <laughs> That's changed, though, in the past few years, thanks to the arrival of free services, such as Google's 411 and the original 1-800-FREE-411. I remember changing to the... the 1-800-FREE-411? Unfortunately, that one is loaded with ads, and Google has just announced it is ending 800 goog 411 on November 12th because it wants people to use its smartphone application instead. Doesn't that stink? So what's a caller to do? Enter the newest free service, 1-800-BING-411. You can find local businesses and even get traffic reports, movie show times, and weather. Not too bad. Some cell phone plans include free 411, but you know, those are very few. With most of them, you pay, and a few calls to 411 can raise your monthly bill by $10 or more. Watch out for them, Lance, so you don't waste your money. And